Yo, hello guys and welcome back again to a brand new video. In today's tutorial guys, I will be showing you how to edit settings.json in Visual Studio Code. First of all guys, if you don't have Visual Studio Code, I highly suggest you guys to download it through your browser. You can download it very simply. Just go ahead and open your Google Chrome or Opera GX or whatever browser you have and then go ahead and click on to the URL section and type Visual Studio Code. So let's be just write it Visual Studio Code. Here we go. And then tap on the code.visualstudio.com, which is this website. After that, let's go ahead and click on download for Windows. And basically, guys, this program or software has multiple languages that you can actually program or develop your scripts with. There's Python, C, C, Debugger for Chrome, JavaScript, C Sharp, whatever language that comes to your mind, you can actually get it from this extension that you can find in the marketplace of Visual Studio. And they are totally free. So after you download the program, let's go ahead and create your account. It will not take you so long. After that, it will be open something around that. Now, in order for you guys to edit settings.json, what you have to do is go ahead and click on view and then go ahead and click on comment palette. This will open this space which is over here. Now what you have to do is click on settings and search like write settings and then search for preference or here you'll find the open default settings JSON or uh, open user settings JSON. So you can do whatever you'd like. For example, let's open this and here it goes. So this is the list. You can go through it. You can change whatever you'd like in this list. And there is like the bunch list, like it is so long. You can do whatever you'd like. Here it is. And you can change whatever thing you would like in these settings. So yeah, guys, that's how we can actually uh, change or edit settings.json in Visual Studio Code. So basically, you just have to go to view and then comment palette and then just type settings and you will find it there. So if you have, guys, any other questions, please leave them in down below in the comment section. And thank you guys for watching.